Hello and welcome. This week, let's talk about specular reflection accessories. Now these can fall into two categories. One, you have your relative measurements and the other, you have your absolute. Now relative accessory is where your results are gonna depend on what you used for your background. Whereas absolute, it doesn't come into play. So today I wanna to really concentrate on our absolute reflection accessory. It's a 12 degree angle of incidence and it has an optical design that we call a VW. So let me show you what that means. It gets its name V because for your background measurement, the beam follows a V pattern. And then when you put your sample in, the beam will reflect off your sample onto that very same background mirror and then your sample again and out. So that mirror is taken into account for both your background measurement as well as your sample. So to get to your results, you'll have to take the square root of the values given by your FTIR. So for your tip this week, I really wanted to take a look at the holder. Right now, the sample holder is in the background position because the beam is going to come in, reflect off the mirror once and back in that V geometry. To collect your sample, we're gonna rotate this holder insert our sample into the holder and place it back on the pins. Now for your tip this week. Because we're reflecting off our sample two times, you're gonna wanna make sure that your sample covers this opening of the holder. And that's about 40 millimeters wide by 20 millimeters tall. So thanks for watching this week and we'll see you next time.